Hello, welcome to the reading room with Siv V here. Today we're going to do a mystery reading and it's on any topic regarding a message that you may need today or tomorrow. We'll see where it takes us. Before we get started, this is group one, group two. Take your time, pause the video if you need more time and enjoy your reading and I'll see you there. Hello, group one. So I'm going to start with this card for sure and these three. And we're going to pull some cards to go with them. But so far, what I'm seeing, the vibe or the focus of the reading seems to be on something that you're receiving, something that's been given to you, a gift, um, an inheritance. I don't know. It seems to be definitely material or money. It's going to be quite a bit or it grows into quite a bit. It's sort of letting you know to take it, but also do something with it. That's what I'm picking up. That seems to be the focus of the reading. So I'm going to pull another card to go with that one. Oh, well, I guess it's not it. Hmm. For sure, you're going to know what to do with it. It's definitely something that you can work with. It's definitely something given to you that has a, it's practical in some way, or it can materialize into more. You have it in you to do something with it. It may not be as big now. It may grow for later. Definitely some type of security. The keys are there in this car, just hanging like it's there, you know, for you to take. It opens up doors. Also picking up that it's not just um, something that you need to sit on. You definitely need to make it grow. It's for the future, generations after you or something like that. Hmm. Okay, so I'm going to pull more tarot oh, right away. So what I'm getting here is that, yeah, it is something that's going to make you very happy. It's extended. It's for the future, whether it's grandchildren, whether it's um, your family, your, your children, then their grandchildren, generations. It might not be as deep as that for you. It may be something that you're sharing with your friends and it makes everybody happy and it changes their lives. There is definitely more than one person. One, one minute. I feel like this is first. Because this is in the direction it's headed. And it's in a good place. It's in a good direction. So you see, you may have something that you've been wishing or wanting or you've asked for it. It's been answered, but it's going to come in many forms. It's going to change many times. It's not something that's, um, well, it is growing. It's growing, but maybe unexpectedly or in a different way than you were expecting. It's not quite as stable as you expect. Something like that. And then this one here, it seems like, yeah, just you're on your way. Even if you don't know it, even if you don't see things um, or you don't understand or you don't even know where this money is coming from or this gift or what's been given to you that you can make grow. It's there. It's coming. Just believe in it. Believe in what is around you. Believe in what uh, you're going to receive. Believe in your future. You know, it, it, you don't have to know everything and you don't have to be scared of it, I guess. Just jump in. And, well, not jump in, but go towards it. Yeah, pick yourself up and let yourself flow with it. Trust your intuition. Trust that it's going to be okay. The path is lit for you. It may not be clear, but it definitely is there. Hmm, quite intriguing. I'm going to find out more about this. Oh. 
Well, here it shows that there is uh, something that you need to focus on. It seems like there's many things in front of you and there's quite a bit of clutter. There's one particular thing that you should focus on and just keep working at it. It's something that you've been wanting to do. It has many phases, many steps, many directions. It needs your attention. Everything else can wait. That's what I'm getting. Oh, you're going to love what comes in. Here's the card of lovers. And, you know, somebody may come in and they share their wealth with you. They share what their knowledge. They share what and how you can handle this. There may be someone that's um, in your life already and they know the direction you should take or they've talked to you about it already. They've let you know what's what. You can trust them. They love you for sure, but they love, um, they take interest in you. They don't think the same as you. They have a different way of seeing things. So yeah, they may be very helpful for you. That's what I'm picking up. Hmm. But I feel like it's your future, your decisions, and you must follow what you're feeling, even if someone's giving you advice. You may ask them and they may give you something different, something you weren't expecting, but it seems to be good. It says, take your time and think it through. You'll figure it out. Okay, hopefully you know what I'm talking about because it seems like for some, what I'm picking up is that is that you're not sure exactly uh, where this is coming from or what gift you're going to be receiving. And for others, it's there. It's been there for a while. It's sitting and you haven't done anything about it or you don't even realize that uh, if you put some effort into it, it would grow. Mm. You've been heard and you deserve this. And this is why you're having this. This is It's been entrusted to you for the simple reason that you deserve it. Hmm. Oops. So here, opportunities are coming. They're there. It's up to you to go for it. So, like, again, if something's being offered to you, it may not be as big as what you think it will grow or it's not what you're expecting, but there's definitely something. Yeah, Something's coming in. You're sitting there looking at it. Uh, do I take it or not? It's definitely, yes. Yes. The issue is you may not take it and you may let it go. You may just be thinking about it too long. So it's, it's time to act on it, time to grab it. You're going to lose out because maybe you're seeing it in a negative way. Well, why would I want that? Or what's that going to do for me? You may have those type of questions. If they come up, things will change. And it's good to take this. It's not what it seems, I guess. Again, the opportunities are there for you to take off and go for it. It's surfing on a wave, you know, like that's not always easy. Well, it definitely isn't easy. It takes some skills, you know, takes practice. Sometimes you'll master it eventually. Maybe it takes years, maybe. For you, it's easy. I don't know. But what I do know, it is your future. So effort is um, something that you need to put into it and it will work out, but yeah, it might not be easy. It may take some time. You may need to find some skills. You may need, you may need to practice. That's all good. But the thing is, it takes action and it's ready for you to go ahead and do this. Maybe you don't know how to invest or maybe you don't know how to make this thing uh, profitable. Either way, go find out the information. That's what I'm getting. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty direct, actually. Hmm. Okay. Sorry, I'm going to put these here for now. I want these again. Hmm. 
this oh okay oh it's this one here that I want this one okay yeah see go for it it says run run towards it grab it it's an extension oh also that I'm I'm having another message you could have been um, given something from also a past generation maybe you don't know you're not aware of it or you just found out um, yeah go for it you deserve it maybe it's given to you from an, someone another source that you thought well that belongs to someone else if it's given to you it's because you need to take it because you're going to do something with it and it's going to benefit everybody anyway and you'll share you know if it's uh, something that grows into a huge amount um, that profits everybody in some way so anyway you're being entrusted with that it's a give and take give enough and now you're you're receiving you're having a big responsibility because they expect that you do good with this. You've asked for this too. Something that you've been wanting or you put it out there in the universe and it's coming to you in a different way, different package and it will change and it will change for the even better and better. Hmm. It says here, take a rest from uh, like, you know, from what you're thinking or st maybe the, don't think so hard like why me or is this fair or should I or shouldn't I it's like no um, really jump into it again change your mind change your ideas change the way you see things and jump into it because it's time it's time for you to take a, a rest or a break from overthinking it's time for you to um trust in yourself and put yourself out there mm, that's what i'm getting okay so i'm going to post some messages for you and see what else there is it says here i understand that everyone has their own unique path and challenges success i know that there is no greater goal than love peace i am a being of love and I release all negative energy. And here it says, life is simple and easy. All that I need to know at any given moment is revealed to me. I trust myself. I trust life. All is well. Well, there you go. So I'm going to leave it there. L group two. So let's see where this message takes us. We start with this one. And I'm going to pull these ones here and I'm going to read this one in a bit. So this is the focus of the reading, the vibe of the reading. And it has to do with uh, the, st the stars in the sky, unlimited possibilities. Decisions, decisions you must take. Decisions you've been taking. Choices that you've taken. It's all about you. Hmm. I feel like this belongs here. Okay, so I'm going to put some tarot with it. Oh, right away. Oh, jealousy. Mmm. So I'm picking up right away. It has to with your decisions. There's a lot of jealousy with your decisions. The more happy you are, the more jealousy you have. So I'm going to... That's a side message. It may not fit everybody. But anyway, be a look, on the lookout for it. Not understanding. Ooh. What is this? I feel like I, did, I know I'm going to want to clarify it, so I'm <laughs> pulling some cards now. We might as well. Okay, and I like the ending, so that's good. This is about you not really knowing exactly what you need to do or want. But you definitely, you know you need to do something. Yeah, meditate if you have to. But it's definitely, put it out there. Put out what you want, but not so much how you say it. 
This is about you wanting something and not knowing how to go about it. So maybe have more faith that the universe will bring it in. Just let them know what you want. That's what I'm sort of picking. I'll read more into this. You're definitely being guided because you're not seeing the full picture and you're holding back from your happiness. So this is what's uh, going on right now that you're not realizing the more you open up, the more you listen to the signs or I'm told that you're being told something from someone and you refuse to listen. So that might be specific. If that's the case, they really have valid information or what they're saying is um, of value to you. So maybe pay attention a little closer, maybe re-ask, I don't know. Anyway, for others, it is definitely uh, being spiritually guided. You're definitely seeing signs or things are being put in front of you so you can understand what you need to do next. You're definitely, uh, lots of opportunities are coming, lots of opportunities are around you, but yet you don't seem to see it. So you, I guess you're going to, or maybe you're afraid and you hold back, you don't go for those opportunities and there is good opportunities you're afraid to make the choice i see well yeah doesn't matter whichever one you pick it's going to be good yeah there's one maybe a little bit better than the other uh, but honestly <laughs> this is a matter whatever you choose will be good because you're going to end up being very happy the outcome is happy it doesn't matter what decision you make just take one yeah that's what i'm picking up here what you're not realizing is that things are manifesting or they're going to manifest in a huge way and you're going to see the result and people are going to be at awe. They're going to look at what you have accomplished or what you're accomplishing or what you're doing and they're like, look at that, look at this. Like, wow, this is great. This looks good. This feels good. This is good. <laughs> sort of something like that. All right. Oh my geez. And also you have to realize how big that butterfly is on your head. I mean, butterflies are transformation, they're changes. It's definitely trying to open up the flower. The flower is sort of closed. But as soon as you decide that, that you're going to wish that flower to be open, then it's going to change in a big way. Your happiness is there. You're just hiding it. It's sort of like behind your dress. But it wants to come out. It's an egg and it's a, full of life. And you're sort of like closing it up. And it's funny because here you have the bird again dressed in feathers and you have eggs on your head. I feel like the message for the ones who have someone that has something to say to you, maybe pay attention more because it seems to be huge. And for others, um, yeah, things are maybe not as easy or you have to take steps that are a little sensitive maybe. You got to kind of like, take your opportunities or go with it but try to do it in a good way not to ruffle too many feathers at the same time seems to be important I guess because you're going to you're going to be happy but someone else is going to be happy with you present it get the message present it in a good way present it right take time out and choose your words so it makes more sense when you're trying to explain something for some reason that could be specific again but anyway this message is i'm picking up all right so i'm going to move on yeah Trust. Trust that things will be fair. Trust that things will be good. The knowledge is there, by the way. And if you don't have it, go for it. Go find it. Knowledge is power. You don't need um, to understand or see everything. Maybe follow more your intuition or trust. Trust that things will be okay. Trust that the, what you're being told, the messages you're being shown, the signs, the sign, like, I mean, the signs, what feels right, what are you being pushed towards, trust, that's what they're saying. Sure, you don't know, and it's a little scary or eerie, or I don't know, can I do this, can I not, there are all types of questions, 
definitely go for it. As you go, things will clear. Things you'll see, you'll see things that it's safe. It's okay. It's out of your comfort zone for sure. It's um, a little afraid. It's risky. It's uh, nothing secure. That's what I'm picking up. Now I understand this card even more. No wonder you don't want to go. No wonder you're hiding certain things about about it or yourself. You're weighing the pros and cons and it just doesn't feel like it's too safe. Yeah, uh, it is. And it's not letting you know. It's just saying, go for it. Look at how green it is. And you're holding the pinnacle. Like you're holding. And so your success is there. You're achieving uh, your goals. The success is coming in. You definitely um, get the promotion. Promote yourself. You grow. You expand. Things change for the better, for the brighter. You're going to have lots of abundance, whatever that means to you. You're on your way. All they want you to do, put your thoughts and trust. So what you want, put it out there. Say it. Say, hey, I want this. I need this. Don't worry so much about how it's coming. Just state it. Where's my other card? Oh, right here. Oof, right away. Don't want me to see it. Okay. Right. That's your choices. Lots of choices. Well, it's funny because they're two very positive cards, but they're in a negative position. So what is this telling me is that you're not putting things together. So you're not understanding certain things. You're not clear. You're not getting it. You're not understanding it. I don't know. It's not, you're not putting it together. You're not mixing it. It's not happening. You're not listening. You're not I don't know things are over your head in some ways. Maybe that might be specific for someone, or you're just um, just not doing it, and you're not believing, you're not trusting, you're not understanding how things work. So that comes back to this card here. It's all brand new. It's it's a new way of um, things are being presented to you or being offered to you in a new way, or you just don't understand how this works. It's manifestation manifesting how to manifest maybe you don't understand or just don't believe in it or something i don't know yeah that's holding you back so much could come in if you would um let yourself go where's my card over here take those risk opportunities just put it out there and go the answer to the solution if you want to succeed if you want to have something, whatever you're really wanting it, focus on it, put some effort into it, take the choice to, to be proactive in it, make it happen, trust in the process. That's what is being said. It's pretty firm too, by the way. It's almost like they're saying, come on, do it, wake up, <laughs> get going. I don't know. It seems that's how the messages are coming out. Okay. Oh, and there's this card here. Oh my goodness. The results are amazing. Look at that. It grows into this stage where you're at the beginning and you're understanding it and all suddenly you just blow up and it blows up into something huge. I have it. I, I made it happen. And now I'm in a good financial position. I have what I want. I have my wish. I, exactly how I want to live life is how I'm living it. It takes time. It's not overnight. But it's definitely there. I love that. You have to want it. And you have to take initial steps. If you're lacking knowledge, then just go find it. If you're not lacking skills, then go learn it. But take the initiative to act on it oh there's the jealousy again yeah because you make things happen definitely jealous 
uh, I feel like you have someone in your surroundings that don't believe in you, don't believe in your dreams, don't believe that you can even succeed, put negative toxic uh, thoughts in your head, um, seems to uh, like the conversations and go with it. Like, you know, if you're going to feel like this, then they're going to promote that. They're going to go, yeah, and they're going to talk along with you. Every time you're putting yourself down, they're there reinforcing it. So there's somebody in your life that's pretty toxic, holds you back. They've been uh, whispering to you how you... <sighs> I got to slow down. The energy is so like powerful. Like They're blocking the messages that come in or they turn them around into negativities when they're actually good. So there's somebody that wanted to talk to you and they had something to say and this person blocks it. Mm. Yeah, once you um, take your power and you uh, realize that you're able, you'll feel safe. doesn't matter what you're going to do. It doesn't matter. Um, you'll ruffle the feathers after all. Well, not at first, but later you will because you're coming into your power, into yourself, into who you're meant to be. And they're not going to be stopping you for long. Here's your victory, your success. You've taken it, you've embraced it, and you flourished. So this is a very powerful message. Okay, I'm going to read these messages here. It says, surrender, I can release my needs to control. Happiness, I am aware that being happy means that I am on the right path. Relationships. I'm attached to those people who serve my higher good. Exactly. <laughs> and that toxic person should really wean them out. Every thought I think is creating my future. Wow. This is exactly what we're talking about. The universe totally supports every thought I choose to think and believe. I have unlimited choices about what I think. I choose balance, harmony, and peace. And I express it in my life. Well, there, that's exactly. All right, I'm going to leave it there.